Welcome to one of the most famous Greek islands. Santorini is renowned for its spectacular views and epic sunsets. But is Santorini just that? <laughs> Let's find out! What draws people to Santorini are the photos of the island's gorgeous sunsets and the breathtaking views of its volcanic cliffs. But Santorini is so much more than that. Santorini is an island of fascinating history with fierce volcanic eruptions and earthquakes that shaped the island as we know it today. It's also an island of remarkable architecture, spectacular scenery and century-old winemaking traditions. Looking past the overwhelming crowds that flock to the island, especially in the summer, Santorini is a special destination to visit in Greece and this video sheds a light on all those features that make Santorini unique. It wouldn't be a video for Santorini if we didn't start with a mention of the island's famed sunsets. The most famous sunset spot in Santorini is the castle of Ia. Undoubtedly, this is one of the best places to watch the sunset in Santorini. The downside is that it can get really crowded. Not only the castle itself, but also all of the surrounding streets. But there's good news. You don't have to be at the castle or anywhere near it to enjoy a magnificent sunset in Ia. Just pick a caldera facing spot anywhere in town and get ready for a unique experience. Apart from Ia, another amazing place to enjoy the sunset in Santorini is Fira. For many, Fira's sunset is even better than Ia's because the sun seems to dive into the crater of Santorini's volcano. However, for a truly epic sunset that beats the crowds, you should opt for a sunset catamaran cruise. Time to sail on a dreamy sunset chasing cruise. There is nothing like embarking on a trip to chase the sunset in the most spectacular setting, Santorini's caldera. During the cruise, you may even get the chance to swim in the waters of Santorini's hot springs. Santorini is home to some of the most picturesque towns and villages in Greece. The most recognizable among them, Ia, is a sight to behold with its one-of-a-kind architecture that comprises former cave dwellings where sailors used to live and imposing captain's mansions, both remnants of Ia's rich maritime history. Ia is utterly romantic, a postcard-perfect town that is unlike any other. Equally quaint, Fira is the vibrant capital of Santorini. Apart from its whitewashed buildings and jaw-dropping views of the volcano, Fira is also famous for being the best nightlife spot on the island. On the contrary, Imerovigli is ideal for those seeking an escape from the hustle and bustle of busy Fira in an exclusive environment that promises nothing but tranquil, relaxing moments. Dubbed the Balcony of Santorini, Imerovigli is the highest point in the caldera side of the island, offering views to remember. Squeezed between Fira and Imerovigli, Fido Stefani boasts similar views and vibes, but with a more authentic touch. Yet, the true magic lies in the lesser-known villages that wait to be discovered. Emporio and Pirgos are probably the most beautiful villages in Santorini. Emporio is home to a fairy tale like castle where time seems to have stood still. This fortified medieval settlement is a fine example of defensive architecture. Pirgos, on the other hand, is visible from almost everywhere as it's the highest village in Santorini. Whitewashed, rugged and crowned by a dramatic castle, Virgos could easily be mistaken for the setting of a period film rather than a real-life village. The best part about many of Santorini's villages and towns is that you can see many of them while hiking. The 10-kilometer hiking trail that starts in Fira and ends in Ia is one of the most impressive hikes in Greece. Not only because you can visit some of Santorini's prettiest towns along the way, but also because the opportunity to hike along the rim of a caldera doesn't present itself every day. Whether you walk the entire length of the trail or just a part of it, one thing's for sure. The wonderful vistas you'll enjoy along the way will stay with you forever. But how did it all start? Let's take a walk around Akrotiri, Santorini's most ancient city. 
Once a wealthy trade center, Akrotiri has a sad story to tell. In the 17th century BC, a devastating volcanic eruption destroyed Akrotiri. In the centuries that followed, excavations revealed the once prosperous city lying under tons of ash. This is why Akrotiri is often referred to as the Pompeii of Greece. Near Akrotiri, some of the island's oldest vineyards grow. Santorini has a long-standing tradition of winemaking and the island is dotted with fantastic wineries where you can learn the island's wine-producing history and sample superb local wine either in century-old cellars or in terraces with stunning views. There are three indigenous wine varieties in Santorini, Acertico, Atiri, and Aidani. It's no overstatement to say that no trip to Santorini is complete without a tasting of the island's exquisite wine. And don't forget, if you want to experience the real Santorini and delve into the local culture, no one can plan a better itinerary for you than J-Way Travel. There's a lot more to Santorini than just its sunsets, views and infamous crowds. We do hope that this video inspired you to search for and experience Santorini beyond the obvious. The real island that has a lot of stories to tell.